Hey, 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 first grade, it's Mr. Rodriguez here. Hey, welcome back to the Mr. Rodriguez Show. Thank you so much for tuning in. Hey, those pop art uh, pieces we did last project, those turned out so cool. Make sure those get turned in the next time you do pick up or drop off. Um, we're gonna get, we're gonna kind of just change some gears here. We're gonna actually uh, do a project that's a little festive. That means we're gonna deal with the holiday season. So this one's gonna be kind of um, follow my instructions and then kind of go your own way with it. Cause what we're gonna do is we're gonna, we're gonna imagine some things real quick, okay? Now, first I want you to think, uh, it's Christmas time. At Christmas time, we get gifts. If we're good, we get gifts from a particular person. I think you've heard of him. I think you know his name is Santa Claus. Uh, pretty famous guy. You see him on the Coca-Cola commercials all the time. We're not going to focus on Santa Claus himself. We're going to focus on the hard work, uh, what I personally feel like is the backbone to the entire Christmas season, the reindeer. Because if you don't have the reindeer, Santa's not going to get from house to house in 24 hours. He's not going to get all around the world if it's not for those reindeer. Those reindeer are hard workers. They fly around the world. So, what I want you to do is kind of just imagine. Imagine if you were a reindeer. Okay? Think about it. If you were a reindeer, what would you look like? It's kind of an odd question, isn't it? It's kind of a weird question to think about, but I really want you to think about, if you were a reindeer, what would you look like, okay? So, we're gonna need a couple things here. You're gonna need your sketchbook, you're gonna need a pencil, and you're gonna need your oil pastels. We're gonna do a lot of coloring and a lot of blending like we've dealt with before, okay? So. I'm gonna hop over to the drawing table here where we're actually gonna draw in the North Pole. So, I'll see you there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so I'm sitting here uh, in the North Pole here and I'm gonna draw myself if I was a reindeer. Now, what this lesson does is it's gonna kind of bring us back to a lot of that blending with the oil pastel and thick coloring. Kind of return to form for that. Uh, so all these blending terms should be right up your window. So I'm going to start off with pencil here, and I'm going to draw myself like I was a reindeer. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's start drawing ourselves as a reindeer. Now, we're going to do this portrait style, which means it's only going to be from like the sternum up, which is just kind of like the face will be right here and then the shoulders will go down here. We're gonna make sure to leave room up top because why? Antlers, there we go. First thing I'm going to do is I'm gonna make a long oval right in the middle of my paper. But again, I'm gonna leave space up top for my antlers. So I'm just gonna do a long oval just like that in the middle of my paper. Awesome, sweet. Then I'm gonna make my shoulder, I'm gonna make kind of a, actually I'm not gonna make my shoulders. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make just two lines that go down like this. It's gonna be my neck. And then I'm gonna make a line that goes straight across like this that goes down and then down like this and that's our shoulders right there. So, that right there is kind of the basis of, of how we're going to start this. Um, I'm going to go into and I'm going to add some antlers and I'm going to throw back some words uh, to the night, the owl, uh, night the owl. I'm going to throw back some words to the moon painting or the moon drawing that we did a little bit ago where we used some zigzag lines kind of right in the middle. We're going to do this uh, with, oops. We're going to actually do this with the pencil right here, and we're going to kind of double up our lines a little bit. So it's going to go start right up here at the top, and I'm going to kind of make some zigzag lines, just like that, okay? 
And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make another line that kind of follows along with it. But then right about here or something, I'm gonna kind of split. And I'm gonna come back up to this one and connect it. So it's like we have kind of a kind of a jagged antler over here. And then I'm gonna do the same thing over here. You don't get too jaggy, you know, too zigzaggy with your uh, V lines, but you know, you can get a little. And then just like that. Awesome. So those are our antlers to our reindeer right there. Now we're gonna go in and we're gonna insert eyes and a nose and a mouth. And how we're gonna do that is we're gonna make two small ovals that sit right in the center of our oval right here. It's gonna go just like this. There's one, and I'm gonna do another one right here. Two. Awesome. And let's throw our, our eyeballs in there. So you can have, I'm gonna have mine maybe looking to the side just for something different. So I'm gonna have my eyes kind of sit to the side of my oval. So it looks like I'm looking that way. Then I'm gonna insert my nose. My nose is just gonna be a triangle. And I'm gonna do it down at the bottom because it's not, a, it's more like a snout right here. And the snout is located at the, at the end of the face for a lot of animals like that. So I'm gonna just go make a, and then the mouth is gonna be underneath this, so we're actually not gonna see that. So there is my face right there. All right, so the next thing that I'm going to do is I am going to uh, go in and I'm gonna draw uh, how I would be a reindeer. What would I look like as a reindeer, okay? I'm gonna think about some personality traits, maybe uh, something about me that I would add into it, you know? Um, how would I look? What kind of shirt would I wear if I'm a reindeer? Uh, would I have a red nose like Rudolph? Would I not have a red nose like Rudolph? Um, little things, like would there be things dangling from my antlers? I don't know. This is your drawing. Watch how I do it, and then I want you guys to come up with your own way. One thing I forgot to uh, to say is we forgot to add some ears on here. So we're gonna add some ears that are just kind of right off the side right here. And they're gonna be kind of like a, a leaf shape that just goes like this. Apologies, but I'm glad I caught it now. So a leaf shape that comes right off the side of the oval. And then I'm gonna make a shape it has some parallel lines that go right in the middle of it. Parallel means they do not touch. It just goes like that right there. All right, now I'm gonna go think about what would I look like as a reindeer? Hmm. Well, first things first, you are going to have a long night uh, hauling Santa around the world. So I gotta think, I gotta be entertained here. So I am actually going to, I'm gonna do, <laughs> I said this idea right here. I am gonna have headphones on. I wanna listen to music, you know? It's a long way around the world here. So I'm gonna actually erase my ears. You don't have to erase your ears. If you wanna add headphones on, that's totally fine too. But I'm actually gonna have some headphones on here. And this is simply for, so I can listen, you know, to a podcast or a, you know, a good record, a good Beatles record or something while I'm traveling around the world. So I got my headphones on there. There's my top part that's resting on my head. Cool. You know what? They're Bluetooth, so I don't have to worry about any, you know, cord or anything. That's kind of nice. Hey, not bad. And it's cold, so I gotta give myself a scarf. And the scarf kind of just goes like this, and it's gonna be blown right off here. Boom, 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 boom. I like that. I'm gonna erase this. I don't have to erase this part in here because when I color it, it'll cover it up. But just for your 
vision. Um, you know what? It's probably pretty windy, so I'm gonna want to have some eye protection. So I think I'm gonna have a pair of glass sunglasses on. That moon's probably pretty bright in the middle of the night. It's right there. Okay. Looking good. Got my jacket on. Awesome. And it's Christmas, so let's let's do some decorative things. I'm gonna have a Christmas bulb dangling right there. Good. Maybe I'll do another one right here. Good. Oh man, look at me, I'm festive. This is all right, ladies and gentlemen. So that's where we're gonna hit pause on our project. Do not hand this project in. We're gonna hand this in. Uh, at the next drop-off. So next week, we're gonna talk about coloring this. Drawing it should take you enough time, um, but blending it with the pastels are gonna take you some time too, and I just didn't wanna give you a bunch of stuff right off the bat to do. So next week, we will color. So keep this in your sketchbook. Do not rip it out and do not hand it in yet. We will hand it in next week after we're done coloring it. I can't wait to see these. So, uh, I can't wait to see these. I'm super stoked about it. I will see you next time.